Today's topic is elements of art. The elements of art are the building blocks of all the arts. Every piece of art ever created includes one or more of these elements. So let's learn about line, color, shape, form, value, space and texture. Learning objectives. After watching this video, you will be able to list and explain the elements of art, identify the element of art in selected works and apply the element of art to your own works. Line is one of the seven element of art. It is considered by most to be the most basic element of art. Line is progressive movement or delineation. We have already discussed the line in our previous video. Shape. In the visual arts, shape is a flat, two-dimensional, enclosed area of an artwork. It can be created through line, texture and color. Shape has height and width. It can be geometrical like uh, square, rectangle, circle, oval, triangle and it, it also can be organic shapes. Organic shapes are available in nature. Form is a shape of volume or mass. It is three dimensional means it has height, width and depth. It can be geometric like cube, sphere, cylinder and cone etc and organic also. Organic shapes are found in nature. Organic shape like vegetables, fruits, mountains and animals etc. Shape refers to the area around, inside or between shapes or form. As we can see in the slide, it has foreground, middle ground and background. ये तीनों जो grounds हैं foreground, middle ground and background ये picture को meaningful बनाती हैं otherwise अगर ये space illusion नहीं दी होती तो background जो थी वो बिल्कुल flat होती और जो human figure है वो बिल्कुल stick हुआ हुआ लगता और एक three dimensional effect नहीं आ सकता था painting में Space makes the form more visible and clear. If no space was left between two printed lines of a page, those will become meaningless and we would feel strain on our eyes. So space is very essential. Imagine a room where there is no space left for us to walk. In such room, we would feel as we are being put into a prison. In the same way, space is essential in a spoon to help us to carry the food. One more kind of space which we must know lies between the work of art and the beholder. For example, Taj Mahal stands majestically on its platform, would lost its visual appeal if no space was left in front of a building. Texture is the surface quality of a material. It can be either visual or tactile. Visual texture 3D surface ka imitation hai. Jaise hum painting mein water, uh, mountain, grass or tree ka texture dete hai. Wo sirf ek illusion hai 3 dimensional art ki. Tactile texture actual texture hota hai. Jaise koi cheez rough hoti hai, koi cheez silky hoti hai. कई चीजें स्मूथ होती हैं तो ये एक्चुअल टेक्सचर होता है टेक्टाइल टेक्सचर वो है जो हमें हाथ से टच करके पता चलता है वैल्यू इज डिफाइंड एज रिलेटिव लाइटनेस और डार्कनेस ऑफ कलर इट डिफाइंस फॉर्म एंड क्रिएट स्पेशल इल्यूजन पेंटिंग एक टू डायमेंशनल मीडियम है पेंटिंग में विथ है और पेंटिंग में लेंथ है उसकी जो थर्ड डायमेंशन है डेप्थ वो हम वैल्यू से क्रिएट करते हैं आर्टिस्ट कलर्स की वेरियस वैल्यूज से पेंटिंग में हाइलाइट्स शेडोज 
या शेडिंग देता है जितना हम किसी कलर में ब्लैक मिक्स करते जाएंगे कलर की वैल्यू उतनी हाई होती जाएगी उतना हाई कंट्रास्ट क्रिएट होता जाएगा और जितने हम एक कलर में वाइट मिक्स करते जाएंगे उतना वो कलर लाइट होता जाएगा और पेंटिंग में हाई के काम आएगा वो कलर कलर इज वॉट वी सी बिकॉज ऑफ रिफ्लेक्टेड लाइट और वी कैन से कलर इज द एलिमेंट ऑफ आर्ट दैट रेफर्स टू रिफ्लेक्टेड लाइट इन आर प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड वेरियस टाइप ऑफ कलर्स लाइक प्राइमरी सेकेंडरी कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री एनालोगस एटसेट्रा Knowing these elements will allow you to analyze and appreciate about art, as well as being of help should you create art yourself. Thank you.